Hi everyone, the Lone Wolf here. Welcome back to some EVE Online and I'm on my way to a Serpentify Outpost. Serpentify Outpost has actually been nerfed a little bit from the looks of it by CCP um, in the loot department. So we'll show you that um, once I can. Uh, this is also a little bit of a test because I got a new computer and a new microphone. So I'm doing uh, a shadow play recording with the voice recording uh, done at the same time so through the shadow play recording as well i hope everything will work out uh, if you see or experience any problems definitely uh, put that in the comments and then let's just keep an eye on this scan we've got an atron here so normally normally there is nobody in this serpentify outpost and i'll be able to do it so the site itself has uh, not changed um, but i'll show you guys in a moment what has at least in, in like the last two three that I experienced it's it's what uh, it looked like so we'll take a look and um, what I've found works really well here is to have uh, one ogre on on the safeguard and then have the other ones take care of that cruiser because well, if at least he would hit at least uh, finally so one ogre uh, can also two shot that safeguard and usually it's in sync and then they explode at the same time of course this is my greedy ishtar so we are back with the guards here let's take care of the frigates first like that and i had to put all my settings back so it was a little bit of um, remembering where everything was um, but i think i'm pretty much there now let's uh kill some more stuff here definitely try to take care of the figure first uh, i also do keep an eye on this scan why in case of competition and i am not seeing any probes or other ships normally i should be okay but you never know if competition comes in uh, what i might want to do is actually focus on the cruisers try to get those down before anyone warps in and then just uh, do the the final part um, frigates with uh, hobgoblins while i actually head for the gate or something like that so let's get started on those it's going decently well and then let's not forget here save location a wreck and that's actually what has been nerfed and you'll see that um, if everything goes the way it went since the last patch uh, just Killing the battleship actually despawns uh, the site and so you can't get the red container anymore. It's not a big nerf of course, but it's a little nerf uh, in the loot. You know, if you want to get all the possible best loot, uh, then what you have to do is risk more time in this first room. Uh, go after the container. Let's actually go for that wing leader that's close by. That should be a bit better to hit. Um, but yeah, you need to spend a bit more time on this if you also went, want to get that red container and you don't always have that. Uh, RS... Uh, I don't think so, but might try it. So let's uh, see if we can speed it up a little bit here. Maybe also put one guy on this. I'm actually in range of the wing leader now. Let's also look at the new camera option. So. Well, let's hope he actually blows up pretty soon come on guys finally there you go the ac camera actually lingers around the explosion a little bit and after that you get back so that's really awesome and that's definitely going to help to record live events now let's see if we can take care of the rest here that dies that dies this can helios yeah all right could actually I've just scanned this down and uh, sit at the gate for a warping or something like that. For an alt, that's something that you do see done once in a while. When you explore a lot. Luckily, first room is done. Yep, here we go. Sister core scanner probe. So I'm definitely not going to linger around. And it's going to show you guys uh, the, the nerfing. Um, a little bit of nerfing from the uh, revenue you get from fire outposts like this because of course that red container it has a small chance for faction loot and sometimes it can really make uh, a fire outpost that much more profitable so someone is is finding it but hopefully i get to the gate before they warp in and uh, if that's the case i 
don't think will be at any risk anymore so moving in of course we also have to do a little prayer to Bob for some good loot but as we all know Bob works in mysterious ways so you never know what you're gonna get but let's go 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 probes are still here that's good nobody on grid probes still here I'm um, to the second room so normally we should have this in the bag Phi operation protector target put my guards out start firing mobile tractor unit and here we go only two hits that's not so good five hits that's a lot better let's hope he can actually speed up in my direction yeah it takes a bit of a what the hell is he doing no he's actually stuck on the structure a little bit that's gonna delay the kill Cerberus coming in let's hope he doesn't try for uh, the room then two Cerberus already U100 U118 you see that could be with the uh, Helios uh, you know you have uh, a scanning alt then you get a couple of, of good cruisers that uh, just rush through the sights um, it just makes you a bit more efficient and uh, sometimes that can really help in the meantime the cruisers for instance you can put them on the refuges or whatever other uh, combat anomalies are available uh, but looks like they're back out actually so I think we'll be okay I do always get at least one guard into armor because of all of this but should just be a couple more volleys and then I should be all right uh, maybe I'll try and, and grab one of those well, actually I don't want to have them out too long anymore I think Let's see if they can do anything but yeah look at that almost through the armor grab the loot please thank you Let's return these guys and grab this. Have my salvage drones ready. And yep, yeah, pray to Bob that it's a good drop, of course. 12 kilometers. Yeah, sister probes are still out. This actually does make me feel that it's someone with alts. Uh, it, there's pr plenty of other signatures, but having the Helios come in on the gate. And then have your cruisers have that warping without needing to do all the bookmarks and stuff is, is how that generally works and let's take a look here 15 and a half million all right uh, not the best i've seen but definitely quite okay we'll uh, scoop that to the cargo hold and then i'll show you guys what i normally do here is i bounce off a planet then i come back to the first room grab that red container and then the side is done so we are out of here uh, normally not too long after the battleship has exploded i mean this is pretty much in line by the time the uh, loot is tractored to my ship um, and salvaged i get the hell out so i don't think i wasted that much time and uh, i would always get the side back but now let's head over here i think you can also see that the signature itself is gone yeah no more sir pinties five outpost to spot and back in we go but we will unfortunately land right on the wrecks in an empty site and honestly i actually think considering what we saw on this scan that we have the probes here that we saw uh, the uh, the scanning ship as well probably giving the warping to the cerberus um, i think it's the right choice to just go straight for the battleship and don't worry about the red container but as you can see no more gates and no more extra loot extra possible chance for faction uh, drops here so yeah the serpentis fire outpost looks like it's actually been nerfed just a little bit uh, and that's what i wanted to show you guys for this video also of course testing some of the new equipment thank you very much for watching guys and i'll see you all next time